over a chopping at the bit to get to his opponent. One of the most intimidating superstars to ever grace the WWE locker room. When you face off against Goldberg, you know you are next. Absolutely, Byron. You have to worry about your name being added to the long list of names that have fallen at the hands of Goldberg. And standing across the ring is a bona fide legend out of Memphis, Tennessee, Jerry the King Lawler, one of the craftiest veterans this business has ever produced. Yeah, don't let the commentary career fool you. Lawler ruled the territories back in the day. He knows how to mix it up, knows how to play dirty, and doesn't have a problem doing it. Corey, let's talk about Goldberg's approach tonight. Does he stay with his raw power or add some surprise with a bit more varied offense? For Goldberg, you have to go with what you know. Channel that uncaged fury that's rocket launched you to such historic heights. Ooh. Ooh. Strikes with a kick. Ooh. And Lawler took a solid shot. I'm having flashbacks to when I hit Jerry that hard. <laughs> he can end it here. And still hanging on. He really thought that was it. We got a cover. Kicks out after one. Giving a massive effort to overcome the pin attempt. Pretty drop kick. Goldberg setting him up. Here it comes, Byron. We're going to see it. We're going to see it. We're going to see the... Down with the jackhammer. Is there any life left in the king? And he's still in the game. I don't know how he did it, but he's hanging in there. Just how much pain is he willing to endure in this match? I don't think I've ever seen Goldberg in more shock than right now. He's in absolute disbelief over that kick out. <laughs> Drop kicked all the way to the floor. And he's taking this to the outside now. He'll take things into the ring. <laughs> oh, what a punch. Words off that offense from Lawler. The Hall of Famer with a... Does he get it here? And that'll about do it, folks. Here is your winner, Goldberg! Wrestle perhaps the perfect match. Never any doubt in this win. An absolute statement by the victor here tonight. What a steamrolling. Jerry the King Lawler starting things off tonight with a timeless old school style that hits as hard as you can imagine. Lawler is so crafty and he has absolutely no shame to win at any cost unless he's wrestling you, Michael. It's true. His only documented weakness is, well, it's me at WrestleMania. And across the ring is, believe it or not, Cowboy Brock Lesnar. You say that like he's not going to suplex you. Don't mistake Lesnar's geniality for a lack of brutality. He has lost absolutely zero of his killer instinct. He just got a new hat. Ah, oh, saw it coming. He steps foot in the ring again. He turns it around on Lawler. One reversal after another. These two are reading each other's minds. Atomic drop. Ooh. The wind up. And the pitch! Uppercut! A surprising lack of brutality from Lesnar there. Yeah, that crafty Memphis style from Lawler paid off. And Lawler's maintaining the advantage now. You don't see Lesnar flustered like this very often. How do you tackle the gargantuan challenge of defeating a superstar like Brock Lesnar? When you're up against Brock, it's time to go big or go home. Forget about jabs and locking up. You've got to bring out the big guns right away and hit Brock with high-impact offense over and over again. And back in the ring we go. Brock with a punch. Looking worse for wear in the corner now.
to take a trip to Suplex City, courtesy of the Beast. To Suplex City. Cowboy Brock is ready to put the horses to bed. Talk about riding roughshod. And he's able to reverse. Lesnar quick to counter. Counter after counter. Vicious right forearm. Short clothesline hits its mark. Larian. Oh, Lesnar! Kimura lock applied. Can you imagine what it would do to his confidence? He doesn't yeah. have much time before his arm snaps. Great job fighting out. into the backbreaker. Punched to the stomach and stopped in their tracks. Back and forth, back and... Michael Cole takes shelter. Here comes the storm. With an F5. Bang. Has brought delivered the exclamation. His opponent thought he had it in the bag for sure. This is when you have to switch game plans. You can't let yourself get discouraged. And Brock is bewildered. Brock has no clue how that just happened. Getting him into the corner. Boom! What a right! Looks like King is loading up. Kick to the stomach. Puts an end to that. For a beast and corner. Looking to end this. Lesnar. F5. Is there any life left in the King? Clubbing blow. Followed up with a hellacious knee lift. You have to think these competitors expected this to be a difficult challenge. Even so, at this stage, things just get more and more dangerous. Fatigue starts setting in, and you don't know exactly have all your wits about you. It could quickly lead to error. Lesnar with a waist lock. I think we're about to take a trip, gentlemen. This is where Brock Lesnar is at home. Ooh. Byron, grab your little dog and warn your aunt. Oh, five! Well, that proved to be enough this time. Cover! Two! And a win! That may be one of the biggest wins of his career. Here is your winner, Brock Lesnar! They just won a very important match. That was a dominating showing where we saw the beast Brock Lesnar just annihilate his opponent. That's what Brock does best. Superstars as cold-blooded as the apex predator Randy Orton. There's something deeply disturbing when he locks his eyes on his opponent. Yeah, it's definitely chilling at times, Michael, but we've also seen a softer side to Randy in recent years, which I, for one, really enjoy seeing. Yeah, Byron, but I wouldn't dare view that softer side as weakness. If anything, that's just how Orton draws his prey in closer. And standing across the ring is a bona fide legend out of Memphis, Tennessee, Jerry the King Lawler, one of the craftiest veterans this business has ever produced. Yeah, don't let the commentary career fool you. Lawler ruled the territories back in the day. He knows how to mix it up, knows how to play dirty, and doesn't have a problem doing it. Look at this, just unloading. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. 
And the Viper is more than just a fancy nickname for Orton. It really speaks to how he puts himself in a position to win these matches from his movements to his demeanor. Right you are, Cole. Orton's found a lot of success over the years by picking his opponents apart piece by piece. No doubt he plans on sticking with that winning strategy. Placed in the corner. Shifts it back onto him. Catches a punch. Orton able to counter. Seeing an answer for every move attempted. Is there any life left in the king? Two count. Oh, he gets the shoulder up before three. I do not know how they got up from that. Operating on pure instinct and adrenaline right now. Orton has ended so many matches with that, but it did not do the trick just then. Some serious cover. We're going to put this one away. Hooks the leg. Wait a minute. Using the ropes here for leverage. Still has a great amount of fight in them. Not going to let it end like this. Sit crashing to the floor. the Vipers attack. Great job refocusing to reverse that. DDT by Orton. After that move, Orton can see the victory in his mind. I don't think you can ever know what's... This could be it. Cover for the win. No, stops the count at two. Both competitors digging deep into their well to keep this match going. Things are getting risky. This will not end well. Back suplex. Spine crushing. And gets tossed back into the mat. He gets sent down to the floor. Randy Orton feeding off this electric crowd. Viper strikes, he does not hold back. Emphatic statement from the Viper. Two! Wow, just barely making it out. Where in the world is he getting this from? His beating heart will not be stopped. Orton a bit dismayed, but we know the Viper is adept at remaining on the offensive. We continue to see incredible perseverance from these competitors. The war continues to rage on with no superstar willing to give an inch. Hey! Rear chin lock and now just rapid fire punches. Oof! So evasive. Planning on what to do next. Oh, went to the throat. This is what you call high risk, high reward. He's positioning himself, closing in. From the top. Double axe handle. Over. And there's the cover. And Orton just barely manages to escape a pinfall. I understand the sentiment but now is not the time to bask in disbelief. Oh my goodness. Ah, what a smash. That is just insulting. Oh, oh I hope they back up. They're, they're getting too close for comfort. Oh, no one's paying attention to you, Saxon. They're too busy beating the tar out of each other. And he slides him back to the mat. Lawler headed top rope. 
from the top. Oh, an elbow drop. Oh, it's a piercing elbow. The Viper in bad shape here. Yeah, King is appearing on stop. From the middle rope. Oh, what a splash. Takes another trip to the skies, and it pays off once again. Blast off. He paid for that one. Oh, man, big time. Waller with the kick to the gut. Oh, here comes the pile driver. That could end Orton now. Is it enough? The cover. He's still in this fight. That was amazing. Orton is still in this. The Viper still has a lot of fight left in him. A new strategy is needed right about now if that couldn't end things. It's been a hardship for these superstars to get to this point. I think these fans are driving them to claw that extra inch. You can sense the ride these fans a bit on it, and I'm right there with them. Scary pattern starting to form as that upper area takes more damage. Any more hits in that area could leave him dizzy. Care who you are, you can't survive any more of those. And that's it. The blood and sweat put into this match, well worth it. Here is your winner, the Viper, Randy Orton. This is the type of victory where you really have to weigh the costs against the benefits. I don't know if I'd say the battle scars were worth it, Cole, but I will say the one who did it to them isn't the one celebrating right now. Assassin Triple H here tonight, one of the most calculating, methodical superstars in all of WWE and sports entertainment history. Always has a game plan, always has the gear spinning in his head whenever he's in the squared circle. If Triple H has his way, tonight's matchup should be a clinic. And standing across the ring is a bona fide legend out of Memphis, Tennessee, Jerry the King Lawler. One of the craftiest veterans this business has ever produced. Yeah, don't let the commentary career fool you. Lawler ruled the territories back in the day. He knows how to mix it up, knows how to play dirty, and doesn't have a problem doing it. He turns it around on Lawler. Franking the arm. And a kick. Oh, continued punishment. Focusing on the shoulder like that can be felt all the way to your fingertips. Look at this. Oh, from the rope. On the mark. He's looking a little off balance. First drop. Oh, look at what a blow. Carefully measured right. And Lawler's maintaining the advantage now. Triple H needs to dig deep like he's done so often before. He's been placed in the corner now. Oh, what impact. The King is going up top. For a second there, I thought we would cover. Is it enough? Three, no. A long two and a half in the waning moments of this match. Oh, look at carefully measured punch right on the ear. Filthy. The arm getting pummeled. Triple H facing a beatdown. Yeah, King is appearing unstoppable. Had that one's. Both arms hooked. That's the game changer. That's gotta be it. Two. What a kick out. I don't believe it. No telling how much surviving that will cost, though. I don't know how someone kicks out of that. I don't know how you can still be standing. And you can see the gears in Triple H's head turning as he's racking his brain for a new scheme to get the win here. Sure, he's pumping himself up, but he's also giving his opponent a chance to recover. Intimidation, part of what makes Triple H the cerebral assassin. Ugh. Tagged with a 
Punch. The ring. He may get the three count right here. This is it. Kicks out. What do you have to do to put this guy away? You have to imagine we're hitting the late stages of this matchup. Who's going? Ah, uh, here you go. Both arms hooked. Pedigree. Is there any life left in the cage? Makes the cover. Still in it. What a gutsy performance. Triple H so used to ending matches like that, but tonight is going to be just a little bit tougher for the game. Look at this crowd. It's insanity in here. Bedlam. Textbook vertical suplex. Bam. Oh, atomic drop! Triple H with the counter. Quick exchange of counters there. Series of reversals. Bang it back with their own counter. And an inverted atomic drop! Legs caught! One response after another, back and forth we go. Fast press! Fast press! Fast press! He is mentally and physically exhausted now. Yeah, this match has not been kind to him. Crank in the head. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Overwhelming offense from the King. Rough spot for Triple H to be in. Great reversal. Triple H able... Ah, uh, here you go. Triple H has this all sewn up. Extremely competitive match. Triple H remains the king of kings with that big win. Comparable Goldberg clearly ready for action. Always is. And you have to imagine he always will be. Intensity, explosiveness, aggression. When you think of Goldberg, you cannot help but think any combination of those three words. Honestly, Byron, those words might just be understating what Goldberg is like in action. Good thing we're here to see him in action firsthand. And standing across the ring is a bona fide legend. Oh, and soon we could be seeing a submission here. Abdominal stretch. It's locked in. It's Abdominal stretch. Fighting out of That's it. That's one way to get out of it. Bam. Avoiding contact. Oh, what a right hook. Oh, look at this. Look at oh, him. man. Inside out. He saw it coming. Left by the turnbuckles. Close line in the corner. Goldberg's overpowering offense and dominance is mythical. Corey, what is the key to victory if there is a key to victory going up against Goldberg? Try to get Goldberg to make a mistake. Here he goes for the win. Then he closes it out. Wards off the pin at two. He just won't give up. I uh, able to counter. Wicked clothesline. Going up top. From the top. Oh, God. My goodness. 
that did not go as planned. Might have been a bad plan to begin with. Uh-oh. And that stops whatever Goldberg had intended. Ooh! And King moves. And one more reversal. Talk about evenly matched here. Another reversal. Eye for an eye here. Big time atomic drop. I don't have you walking funny. Oh, he retaliates. Goldberg with a split could do it. It's over. All in a nice work. Here is your winner, Goldberg! And that seemed like a pretty easy day at the office right there. Never a doubt, barely a moment's suspense. This one was about as lopsided as they come. you could use to describe Brock Lesnar. Warrior, cowboy, but none fit him exactly as Beast. There's never been a superstar that has personified dominance like the Beast incarnate, Brock Lesnar. The mere presence of Brock Lesnar in the ring fills this arena with an air of anticipation. Everyone wants to know what level of carnage he will unleash in this match. I think it's a safe bet that Lesnar will exceed whatever your expectations might be in that regard. When it comes to in-ring competition, Lesnar never holds back. And standing across the ring is a bona fide legend out of Memphis, Tennessee, Jerry the King Lawler, one of the craftiest veterans this business has ever produced. Yeah, don't let the commentary career fool you. Lawler ruled the territories back in the day. He knows how to mix it up, knows how to play dirty, and doesn't have a problem doing it. In my opinion, what makes Brock so dangerous is the fact that he knows just how good he is. That really allows him a mental edge that I'm not quite sure of how you overcome when you're in the ring with him. The key, if you can survive long enough, is patience, Cole. Lesnar's been known to play with his food rather than take the easy W. And that, in turn, can leave him somewhat vulnerable. In the cover! The count. He's determined to keep this matchup going. Stomping down. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Measured up and boom. drop. Lesnar is overwhelmed. Lesnar is overwhelmed. And I can't believe it, but Lesnar looking vulnerable here. Patience paying off big time. Sharp punch. Punch lands. Punch connects. Able to reverse. Snap air. Fast drop. Nasty. Lesnar cuts him off. Lesnar showing he's not out of it. Brock weathered the storm and wants to hail down thunder of his own. Could be it. He kicks out at two. Almost inhuman at this point. Boom! It's okay, they weren't that pretty anyway. This has become a monumental struggle for these competitors. It is down to who still has the energy, the resolve, to put the pedal to the metal. Brace for impact, here it comes. The Beast Incarnate with a two and a five. Good night. Is there any life left in the King? Kicks out, just kicked out. Within inches of victory, only to have it snatched away. Oh, I think we're gonna see it. Lesnar. He's got the answer for that 
that one. Measured up, and fist drop. And Lesnar got met with resistance there. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. The roar of this crowd has been building, and they are at a fever pitch right now. You can feel the anticipation growing with every second that ticks past in this match. Ooh! He moves just in time. And both athletes... Brock Lesnar, the beast unleashed! Brilliant! Ooh. Ooh. Lesnar's got this closed up. There's two! Guys, he put him away! That's a pretty big win! Here is your winner, Brock Lesnar! Huge victory tonight for Brock Lesnar! That was a dominating showing where we saw the beast Brock Lesnar just annihilate his opponent. That's what Brock does best. might just be one of the most enduring superstars in the history of WWE. But over his long and decorated... Oh, hold on. Is he thinking of the submission here? Abdominal stretch. It's locked in. This Abdominal stretch. Fighting out of That's it. That's one way to get out of it. Ooh. What is the Viper planning next? Uh-oh, familiar offense by Orton. Opponent draped over the middle rope. Oh! Orton looking as lethal as ever delivering that attack. Well, some things change, but Randy Orton stays as deadly as ever. What a knockout punch! Oh, oh man! Randy Orton seems less intense than we've known him to be, Corey. Has the Viper lost his venom? Not in the slightest, Cole. If anything, that presumption often gives opponents a false sense of security. You cannot take your eyes off Orton for a minute, or he will make you pay the price. Face first with a waistlock takedown. Ooh! Lifting up their opponent. What's in store? Thunderous right hand. Oh. Randy Orton gets him back. Taking this one back to the ring now. Wards off that offense from Lawler. He returns to the ring. Getting carried around. Bad spot to be in. Power bomb all the way to the outside. Being sent out like yesterday's trash. Just goes to show you the level of animosity here tonight. Gets inside the ring. Is there any life left in the king? Rope breaks the hold there. Ooh. And Lawler took a solid shot. I'm having flashbacks to when I hit Jerry that hard. <laughs> it's attacks like that one that have made Orton such an enduring superstar. Unloading with an uppercut. Landing the uppercut. Oh, we know what comes next. Hung up on the rope. DT. He could pin his opponent right here! It's over! Stopping the refs counted too. Really had less than a second to stay alive there. And the cover for the win! He's able to beat a two count. All the punishment he's taken, and yet he's still in this match? Oh. Orton might take it here for the win! Two! And they're still in this! Not about to go quietly into the night. That took some serious endurance, I'll give you that. Oh, nowhere. The 
can't take any more of that. This must be over. And that'll do it. It's finally over with the win. Here is your winner, the Viper, Randy Orton. What a win for him here. He really displayed his prowess in victory. Randy Orton's legend continues with a big win here tonight.